In today's video, we'll be looking at Google's Notebook Alarm. That turns any document, YouTube video, or resource you give it into your personal research assistant. And from what I have seen, I would consider this the most criminally underrated tool in the entire AI space. And yes, it can even make podcasts. So here's the deal. With Notebook LM, you get three massive advantages. First, you can start using it completely for free just with a Google account. Second, it only answers from your documents or links. No more AI hallucinations. And third, you can chat with up to 50 documents at once. And that's a free plan. If I'm on the pro plan, it's 300. Just for reference, 50 documents are 25 million words that you can put into this thing. Now, it won't look at the data on all of the internet for you, like a Google search or maybe a ChatGPT search would do. But for research, this thing is unbeatable. And using it is super simple. All you need is a Google account to log in, some PDFs, YouTube videos, or websites to analyze, and a basic understanding of a chat interface like you would find in ChatGPT. Once you're logged in on the notebooklm.google.com, you just click create new notebook. And here comes the magic part. It asks you to add different sources. So what I'll do for this tutorial, I'll just upload this research paper that I happen to really enjoy. It's about the potential of AI replacing a therapist. Not to spoil it, but <laughs> it's definitely not there yet. But that's a research topic we'll be building our notebook around here today. I'll rename the notebook to AI therapy project and notebook LM immediately creates a summary of everything that you add to the sources here on the left side. And then if I ask questions down here, you will notice that it answers them based on just the documents that I added to it with little references next to them showing you exactly where it found this information. You can use this just like ChatGPT asking follow-up questions to get to what you're looking for. Now, if there's YouTube videos like this one that I particularly enjoyed, I'll just go here, say add, link to a YouTube video, insert, and now my notebook will update with these sources. And here's the first pro tip. If you only want to chat with one source, let's say I only want to talk to this YouTube video, make sure that just this check mark is set. I'll restart my chat up here and ask a brand new question. And now the answer will only be based upon this source. Now, if I really like this answer and I want to save this for future reference, you click save to note. And that's sort of like no something down in your very own notebook. But here's the killer feature that you might have seen already. People use this all over social media. When you have your sources loaded in here, you can just click this button, audio overview, and it will create a podcast that summarizes all of these sources for you. So you don't have to read about all the documents that you add to the sources. You can listen to them, which I don't know about you, but me as an avid YouTube and audiobook enjoyer, I do personally prefer this to reading articles and such. And here's a secret many people overlook. If you go to the free dots, you can customize it and you can specify the tone, the length, and most importantly, the focus of this podcast. Can AI, you know, artificial intelligence, actually replace humans, mm -hmm. especially when it comes to something as deeply personal, as nuanced as therapy and emotional support? That's such a critical question right now. And we've got some, well, fascinating material to explore. It sounds incredibly good and it's accurate to the source materials. And if you want, you can even go into this interactive mode where you yourself can start interacting with the hosts. Hey, what's up? Hey there, listeners. So glad you're joining us. We're just kicking off this week's deep dive. Yeah, glad you're here. We're diving into something super relevant today. Two more killer features to be aware of here. On the one hand, you can do the same things for video reviews, where it sort of creates a PowerPoint presentation with a voiceover guiding you through the whole thing in video form. And two, you can turn the content into an interactive mind map or one of these formats over here. So at the very core, what matters here for somebody new to this application? Well, the free account lets you add 50 sources here on the left and you can generate three to five audio overviews use a day. And remember, it will not browse the web, access content behind paywalls, or look into its own knowledge base. It's just an AI that sticks to the sources you give it, citing everything precisely. You can use it for any research purpose, book summaries, meeting notes, trip planning, studying, or when you're learning about new topics. But it doesn't stop there. Let me tell you, I've even consulted some lawyers that use this to get an unfair advantage in the courtroom. They throw all of the sources relating to the case into here, generate a bunch of podcasts and get a level of information that no human without a tool like this could ever consume. And there you go. We just turned multiple dense documents into an interactive AI assistant and a podcast summary in just a few minutes. If you want something to try right now, upload your latest free documents into here and ask Notebook LM about the patterns that you might have missed. And if you enjoyed this video and want to see more quick tutorials like this, check out this playlist over here. And with that being said, my name is Igor and I hope you have a wonderful day.